you're one hallelujah away from your breakthrough, don't quit. You're one thank you Jesus away from your promotion, don't quit. You're one glory be to God away from your next level, don't quit. You're one bless your holy name away from God simply blowing your mind, don't quit. Good morning and welcome back to your spiritual sports segment on Rima Gospel Radio. Better than when you heard it last week. I'm CJ. Here we go. The weekend was jam-packed with excitement as my lovely bride threw a complete surprise birthday party weekend full of events for me. But I digress. You can catch more on that at CJ's Commentary Corner. And the Wild World of Sports was also jam-packed with excitement over the weekend as the National Basketball Association wrapped up the Eastern Conference Semifinals as the Boston Celtics advanced to the Conference Finals in the East over the Philadelphia 76ers in Game 7 and will face off against the Miami Heat on tonight. However, comma, I digress as the Western Conference Finals kicked off as the San Antonio Spurs battled the Oklahoma City Thunder and the Spurs was able to hold on to notch the victory to claim the first game in the series as Manu Ginobili poured in 26 points and Tim Duncan grabbed 10 rebounds. The Queens of the B-Ball Hardcourt had two games in action as the Indiana Fever pummeled the Atlanta Dreams 7-8-62 as Tamika Ketchins had a double-double with 25 points and 12 rebounds. And the Seattle Storm were clobbered by the defending champion Minnesota Lynx 84-71 as Maya Moore notched 19 points. The American League had seven games on the diamond yesterday as the Tampa Bay Rays got past the Boston Red Sox 4-3 with the home run from Sean Rodriguez. The Kansas City Royals outswung the Baltimore Orioles 4-2 as Billy Butler belted his 11th homer. The Cleveland Indians were annihilated by the Chicago White Sox 12-6 as the Sox swept the series. The Detroit Tigers knocked off the Minnesota Twins 4-3 as Miguel Cabrera's two-run homer sealed the deal. While the Toronto Blue Jays were outmuscled by the Texas Rangers 12-6 when Ron's second inning proved to be the game changer. The New York Yankees shut out. The Oakland A's 2-0 with the homer from Andrew Jones. And the LA Angels defeated the Seattle Mariners 4-2 as the Angels swept the series. For your London Summer Olympic news, the women's volleyball teams from Serbia, Japan, and South Korea won spots at the London Olympic at a qualifying tournament Sunday. Usain Bolt won the 100 meters in 10.04 seconds in the win at the Golden Spike Meet Friday, his first victory in Europe leading to the London Olympics. Russia finished off the European Gymnastics Championship in Grand Fashion Sunday with four more medals, including goals on the high bar and steel rings. Halle Gebreslase failed to qualify for the 10,000 meters at the London Games on Sunday, finishing outside the top two of the Ethiopian qualifiers at the FBK Games. And finally, Tim Hornsby of Atlanta will represent the United States in the sprint kayak at the London Olympics after beating teammate Ryan Dolan on Sunday at a World Cup event. For your NBA quick dribbles, a trade in the NBA in May usually don't occur. However, comma, the Golden State Warriors are trying to swing one with the Utah Jazz before Wednesday's draft lottery, according to sources. The Houston Rockets guard Cal Lowry told the Houston Chronicle on Friday that he does not think he and Goran Dragic will both return next season and is especially unlikely to play for Houston if Kevin McHale returns as coach, stating, quote, if things aren't addressed coaching-wise, I guess I will be moved, close quote. The New York Knicks has given Coach Mike Wilson the permanent coaching title with a deal that includes two guaranteed years and a third-year option worth approximately $4 million per season, according to Stephen A. Smith. And finally, J.R. Smith of the New York Knicks was arrested on a bench warrant for not having a valid driver's license in South Beach. To have your company sponsor a sports segment, please email me at cjsports, that's C-E-E-J-A-Y sports at gmail.com for more information. To catch archives of your spiritual sports segment, log on to my brand new blog site cjsports.com and make sure you give me that follow on Twitter at cjsports. And stay tuned for more updates in your next spiritual sports segment where we sprinkle a little spirituality <laughs> in your sports. I'm CJ. Be blessed and keep smiling because God has something special in store for you. Thank you.